17 says, when the enemy comes in like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord will lift up the standard. I'm glad tonight that the devil don't have control of this world. I'm glad tonight that the devil only has enough power that God gives him. Amen. There are bodies may be attacked, there are homes may be attacked, but praise be to God, God is still on the throne, God's still in control, and he can sustain us, hallelujah, he can still keep us, hallelujah, until that day. No matter what comes our way, praise be to God, he is still on the throne. Yeah. No matter if the enemy does come in your life like a flood, God, the spirit of the Lord will raise a standard. Oh, hallelujah. When the devil came to try Job, God told Job, I mean, God told the devil, he said, you can try, but you can't have it. Oh, aren't you glad tonight when the devil comes our way that God tells him, you can try, but you can't have it. Oh, praise be to God tonight. We need to realize, though we may be going through trouble, trial situations, but praise be to God, God is still in control of the situation. Let's see. Hallelujah. There was a day when the sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord, and Satan also came among them. And the Lord said to Satan, From where do you come? So Satan answered the Lord and said, From going to and fro on the earth, and from walking back and forth on it. The Lord said to Satan, Have you considered my servant Job, that there is none like him on earth, a blameless and upright man who fears God and shuns evil? So Satan answered the Lord and asked, this Job fear God for nothing. Have you not made a hedge around him and his household all around that he has on every side? You've blessed the works of his hands and his possessions have increased in the land. But now stretch out your hand and touch all that he has and all he will surely curse you to your face. And the Lord said to Satan, Behold, that he has is in your power. Only do not lay a hand on this person. Oh, praise God. The devil may take everything we have, but praise God, he can't touch us. If we're covered by the blood of Jesus, if we're covered by the blood of the Lamb, the devil may come in and take our homes. He may take our families, but praise be to God, he can't take what's deep down inside here. He can't take this praise that we have. Though he may put us in prison, but praise God, we can still in the midnight hour cry out and praise him. He may have us beaten and thrown down to the prison like Paul and Silas, but praise God, when the midnight hour comes, he can't stop us from praising God. Oh, hallelujah, the devil may try a lot of things tonight, but he can't stop the church if they would consider what God has done for them and realize what God has done for them. The devil can't stop us tonight from praising the Lord. The devil can't stop us tonight, hallelujah, if we do decide in ourselves that we want to praise God, Amen. there ain't a devil in hell that can stop us. Those situations may come our way. I battle my a thing with the mind here lately. I quit work. My blood pressure's went down. I'm doing good as for stress, but it's this mind thing lately that I battle daily. This person don't like you, and this person's talking about you. This and that. But folks, though I may battle this, mine thing, but praise be to God, God's still on the throne tonight. Hallelujah, though I may have to battle cancer, praise be to God, when tomorrow morning comes, I'll still be standing up on the rock. Praise be to God, God will put us on a rock, no matter what we have to face, no matter what our bodies have to go against. He's still in control. He's still in control. The devil attacks me every day like that. My God is still in control. My God is still in control. I'm still in the hands of Almighty God. I'm still in His shadow. Oh, I want to get to His shadow. I want to get to that secret place. I believe tonight there's a place that we can get in God. I believe tonight there's a place through praise, through giving thanks to God that we can get in the spirit where the devil has to flee. Amen. I believe there's a place tonight that we can get with God that God will raise up a standard and the devil will have to flee. But what's it going to take? It's going to take us praising him and getting into his presence. It's
so important that we praise him. It's so important that we give him the glory that he deserves. Amen. It's so important that we get to this secret place. Hallelujah. Our families are being attacked. Our bodies are being attacked. Our loved ones are being attacked. One church alone, I know, has four or five people in that has cancer. It's like three or four people out of this pastor's own family has cancer. That's why tonight we need to get to that secret place. That's why tonight we need to get to a place with God, an intimate place. As our pastor said this morning, God's desire for his church. Oh, hallelujah. God is desire for his church in the year 2001 to praise him and glorify him. God's prepared a secret place for us tonight. God has prepared a place for us tonight that man, places man has never walked in. God has prepared for this last day church. God has prepared a place for this last day church that we can walk under the shadow of the Almighty. God has prepared a place, but old church, we can't sit down yet. Oh, no, we got to get to that secret place. Oh, don't grow toward yet. The journey ain't over yet. We still got to go to that secret place. Oh, praise be to God. We still have to crawl. We still have to push. We still have to get to that secret place tonight. There is a place tonight in God that we can get. There is a shadow tonight in God that we can get to. I want to go to that secret place. That's it. I want to enter into that place where no other man has walked. I want to enter into those things that he's prepared for us in these last days. I want to see God manifest. I want to see his glory unfold for this last day generation. I want to see those things. Hallelujah. That secret place. God's made us a place tonight. God's made us a secret place tonight that we can run to. He's made us refuge tonight that we can run from the storm. Though the boat may be going down, but praise be to God. Hallelujah. There's still a place that we can go. Oh, hallelujah. There's a place called the Holies of Holies tonight that we can enter into. Mm. 